Hey you guys, welcome to my channel. This is Karen Sellers. Make sure you give me a thumbs up and make sure you like this video and make sure you are subscribed to me so you guys do not miss any uploads that I do. We're filming outside today, you guys. It is gorgeous out here. You guys may hear cars going up and down the road. You also may uh, hear my kids that are riding their bicycles and you may hear dogs barking. But I hope everyone is doing well. We are outside filming today, like I said. And it is my day off, and I do have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So make sure you guys hit that like button and give me a thumbs up. Okay, we're going to get started with Halloween and fall stuff first, you guys. Um, they're just calling this a container. It looks like a little uh, tombstone with a skeleton on it. Now, they had the white ones and the clear, but I just picked this one up. I thought this one was cool, so I picked it up. And it's got the plastic, but the top does come off, so I picked that one up. And um, this is garland, and it has it's in the silver, and it has these little um, eyeballs on it and stuff that are hanging from it. So, I, and this is uh, nine feet, so I picked up two of those, two of those. And I um, found some new flowers, you guys. These are they're calling these roses, and they are purple. Sorry about that. And they are purple. And they do have little bats on them. Look at these little gorgeous little bats that you can tell right here. Little bats. And they are purple. And they do come with these little um, uh, little limbs on them and stuff, you guys. But I picked up two of these. I've never seen these before. You guys let me know. Leave a comment down below. Let me know if these are new or what. But like I said, they have the little bats on them. And these are done in the purple, so I picked up a few of those. And I also picked up a few of the red. Now these have the little skulls on them. And they also have the like the little twine or vines and stuff with them. But I thought these were cute, so I picked up a couple of these. Like I said, you guys let me know in a comment below if these are new or was these from last year. Because I didn't see them last year, so to me they're new. Uh, I picked up these wreaths. This they're just calling this a wreath ring, a uh, 14 inch, and this one's done in the gold. Maybe you can see that. It's done in the gold, and this one's done in the silver. Y'all hear my kids talking? I apologize for that. Uh, this is a skeleton garland, and you get four of them. And it's the skeleton garland. And you get four of them. This one's head's turned. And they're on this twine right here. But you get four of them. Picked another one of those up. If you guys watched, I did a um, tear tray with those. So I picked me up some more in case I wanted to do another tear tray. And this is a mask. It's a, a leopard or cheetah print. I'm not sure which one. But I thought this was cute. And I like the eyes of it. And I figured since I'm working at Zaxby's, they may not let me um, dress up. But they may let me wear this because so, it's not scary or nothing. So I picked that up for that. And I also picked up these mats, you guys. This one says Hello Fall with the truck on it. And it does have this backing, but you might want to be careful because you might slip and fall because it's they do not hold up very good. They do slip and slide around. This is Hey There Pumpkin with this gorgeous bright pumpkin. My husband loves um, pumpkins and jack-o'-lanterns and stuff. He loves those. And this one says Gather Here. Gather Here. I may give uh, some of these items that you see me haul to my grandmother because she doesn't get out too much. Um, this is called uh, Flocking Balls by Floral Garden. You guys, I am still trying to find each and every color. But I found this one, and they put a off-white one on with these. It's supposed to have five, but they put an off-white one on there with it. I didn't care. I wanted some. And this is, a, I have another one, but it's only got two on there. So I got this color, but I am still looking for all the colors for the Flocking Balls, you guys. And I'm still looking for the Halloween tree. I still have not found that. I would love to come across that. I'm still on the hunt for that tree. 
I, I need two of them to make it look full. Um, this is um, Halloween Tree by Crafter Square. Now, you can use these for fall if you wanted to. I picked up two of them, and they do have glitter on them. I picked up two, and they're on this wood base right here. And it just, you can bend them or however you want to, but I picked two of the green up. Sorry about me reaching over. And I picked two of this, like, burnt orange. It is gorgeous color. I love these trees. So if you guys see these trees, grab them because they will fly off the shelf, you guys. So I picked two in the orange and two in the purple. And I love this purple that they chose. This is a gorgeous purple. I love this. So I picked two of the purple and two of the black. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I love this. And if you go to Walmart, Hobby Lobby, Marshalls, anywhere like that, you're going to pay about $3 a piece to 5 bucks a piece for these trees. So if you guys see those, grab them because it's not a bad deal. Okay, um, this is a four-piece decor piece, and I'm sorry for the paper rattling, but this is the gorgeous purple with, it's done outlined in the orange. Yeah, they're outlined in the orange, and I picked up two packs of these. Because I love decorating with those. So I picked up two of those. And I picked up two. And this is by Crafter Square. And I picked up two packs of the orange. You get four of them. And it has the black dots with the orange. So I picked up two of those. And I hope everyone. Sorry about that you guys. Something fell. Something's always falling. I swear every time I do a video. Something's falling off the table. I do apologize for that. Me bending over and y'all seeing everything. I apologize for that. Anyways, I hope everyone's doing well. And make sure you like my video. Make sure you guys leave me a comment to let me know how everyone is doing. And let me know if you see any wish list items as well. Um, this is a gather sign. And it's in for the fall. And I am looking for the other two. I have not found the other two. But I did find the gather and I love this background. Now, you guys, if you're not happy with this background, you can always pop this back off and redo the background. But I love the way it is, so I'm going to leave it. But if I can't find the other ones, I'm just going to do my own with the other ones that I have. But I do love this sign. It is gorgeous. I love it. And I picked, they're calling, the, this is by Crafter Square Decor Piece. It's the witch with the pot, and I picked it up. And these are really thin, you guys, so you have to be really, really careful. And I picked this jack-o'-lantern up, and they're all done with the twine where you can hang them up, but you don't have to. Pick this one up. And this ghost. To me, this ghost has a jack-o'-lantern face. You guys let me know in a comment below if you think the same thing. I think it has a jack-o'-lantern face, but it's still cute. And you guys... I did not find the red one, but this one says, Happy Fall, y'all. I did find a wagon, but it's done in this, like a purplish blue. But I am glad and thankful that I at least found one of them. And it's with the twine. You can hang this outside without it getting tore up because it is the metal. And you guys... I found these two pumpkins in the blue plaid buffalo check. I didn't think I was going to find these, to tell you the truth, but I grabbed them. Look how gorgeous these are. I love this color. I just love them. So I picked those up. So if you guys see these items I am showing you in your stores, grab them because they will get gone fast. I didn't think I'd ever come across those. And I didn't think I'd come across these. You guys, I found the Velvet Pumpkins. I finally did. And all this stuff coming from Gainesville location. Like I said, it was meant for me to go to that location. Somehow I wound up being in Gainesville. And I've never been to that Dollar Tree. But I'm glad it took me there. Because I found a lot of cool items there. 
and look I love the stem that they did and this is like a royal blue color velvet pumpkin and this is like a turquoise color look how gorgeous these are and they're just calling it a decor piece but look how gorgeous in this like um, white pink color I love this and this is like a burgundy and they all have a gold stem and it looks high-end to me like this looks like something you would find from Marshalls or Target but I love them and I love this green one look at that stem of these they really did these nice. Dollar Tree, you've really outdone yourself with these pumpkins. And this gorgeous goldish yellow. And this um, burnt orange one, which I'm going to have to kind of fix. As you can tell, it's coming up a little bit, but it's okay. I can fix that. No big deal. But look at this color. And they had a lot in Gainesville. They had like boxes and boxes of these pumpkins and the silver I just picked up one of each because I don't need a whole lot just one of each okay and I think that's it for my fall stuff so now we're going to get started with um, just some random items and then we'll get to um, socks and makeup and stuff they're just calling this a decor piece look at this cute little sloth look at his little face and that succulent plant and it has these rocks in here and look at his little hands this is really heavy but this is cute you could give this to gift this to someone this is really cute so I put a little book with it or a candle with it this would be a cute little gift and they also had a gorgeous little panda look how gorgeous that little panda is look at his face with the little succulent plant with the and it comes with the rocks and look at it it's got a little butt <laughs> but um these would be good to give someone like get a little book or something or a candle and just stick it with it and wrap it up that would be a cute little gift for someone okay they had these bells it just says mini bell keychain this one says ring for a kiss and it's done in this gorgeous red and it's on both sides ring for a kiss and it's done with this little plastic thing and that's the red one this one says ring for coffee yes please and it's done in this blue ring for coffee and this one says ring for a smile ring for a smile it's done in this pretty mint green this one says ring for luck ring for luck and it's done in this gorgeous apple green you can give that to someone for St. Patrick's Day and this one is like a really pretty purple purplish pink and it says ring for wine ring for wine and that's what they're calling them this would be cute just to give someone as a gift okay now we're getting to like um, soap and stuff like that I only have like two items and stuff like that this is basic uh, sheer lavender feminine cleansing wipes look how gorgeous this package is now they did have another scent and it was done in the pink label but I'm not sure of the scent of it but I love lavender scent stuff so I grabbed this one up I grab a couple of them up but I give one to my daughter because she has um, gym and stuff and she does work out so I gave her one and this is um, pears soap and this is name brand and this is expensive bar soap so why not save some money and get it at the Dollar Tree 
this is really good for cleaning cleaning your face and stuff with this works really well and I really like it so I picked it up for my daughter and as you guys if you're new to my channel I do like sugar skull stuff I love Halloween stuff anything Halloween I love and I'm doing my kitchen in the bee theme and I just love a little bit of everything really and this is Ioni liquid lipstick and they're calling this cotton candy and I only found one of these you guys and they're calling this cotton candy I'm not gonna um, splotch this because I may be putting this in a future giveaway you guys so this one is cotton candy and it is a gorgeous color and it is a um, long lasting matte finish lipstick liquid lipstick and this one is liquid um, eyeliner extreme black and it is waterproof and that's what it looks like it shows you right here on the side that's what it looks like with a fine tip I may keep this one because I do like eyeliner and this is um, Ioni liquid lipstick berry jam and it's a gorgeous red look at the packaging on it isn't this gorgeous and that's the name of it but that's the only ones I found in that and this is um, the lavender scent bath salt and you get a good bit this is a pretty good size about as big as my hand but I picked this up and you get a good bit in here and it's the lavender scent I picked up there this is by Juncture Woman Slippers this looks like it is a Walmart um, item but it says Greenbrier but look it's a Spider-Man it's got this soft stuff on the inside of it and the Spider-Man print on it this would be good to give a hold back for someone and give it to them as a Christmas gift or a birthday gift I found some Halloween socks you guys this is low cut um, Halloween socks it says hey fabulous with the little ghost on it and these are really soft socks I love that little ghost on there it's cute and this one has the little cat with the mint green and I picked up um, these are Beverly Hills Polo Club uh, five to nine two pack socks they have the dog or cat print with the hot pink and then they have a black pair so you're getting this one and this one and I picked this pair up and the white pair the stars and the blue pair and the stripes and the pink pair and all these are like low cut no show socks and you guys I did not think I was going to come across some gold toes in Gainesville I did I didn't come across a lot but I still came across some this is baseball um, gold toe brand and they got the price covered up so I'm not sure how much these cost but you know how much baseball socks are they're really expensive so I came across this one the white with the stripe and um, this one is uh, gold toe uh, two pair small it says um, with power grip footage and these cost ten dollars for two pair and it's in the green now, I know there are other colors but like I said this is the only color that they had was the green I picked up two packs of these and this is ten dollars each and it has it right here 
on the back. $10 each. And I only paid a dollar. And this is sports socks. So I picked those up for my son. He goes through socks like crazy. I don't know what he does with them, but he does. And this is um, all sport gold toe. You get two pair, and this is in this white. And I'm not sure about the price on these. But you get two pair of the white. And these are really thick. And you get two pairs of those. So I picked one pair of those up. And this is um, a dress texture gold toe sock. Seven for... Seven or three for ten. And this in this brown with this gorgeous print on it. And it does have the gold toe. But I picked that pair up with that gorgeous print on it. I'll probably give these to my grandmother. I picked her up two pairs of those. And this is gold toe extended size knee highs. It has the gold toe. And it has like the little ruffle at the end of it. Let me show you. It's got like that at the end of it. And these are 9 or 3 for 24. I don't know if you can really tell that, but that's what that is. So I picked those up. And I picked up two pairs of these in case my husband wanted one. I know it says for men, but women can wear these too. These are $7 each, and they are gold toe, a no-show. Gold toe, no-show. And it has, like, this little thing on the back of it right here. And it has, um... This little stuff right here. But I picked up two pairs of those. And they do retail for $7 a piece. $7 a piece. Not a bad deal. I did not think I would come across some. I am glad that I did come across a few pair. I wish I can come across the other ones as well. But this is um, George Dress Socks. You get two pair. And it doesn't tell me the price on these, but I did Google it, and it said these retail for $10 a piece. He's just barking at the kids. But you get the Strop It, and you get the black pair. Okay, you guys, that is it for this haul, and I hope you guys enjoyed everything that I showed you, and I hope you ha see a lot of wish lists to add to your items. Give me a thumbs up, and make sure you are subscribed to me. I would love to have you as a YouTube family. Until next time, I will see you then.